you know, I mean, you couldn't, you know, it can be a disappointment, you know, disappointment, but, you know, it's, uh, you know, it's just, you know, I'm just taking it slow, you know, and, um, yeah. Hey, I'm going to re repeat some questions. Sorry, Ish. Um, uh, overall, where do you feel you're at in your recovery and getting back to playing? Uh, I'm feeling really, really good. Um, you know, you know, like I said, you know, I just got to, you know, uh, keep, you know, pushing it out here. You know, just taking, you know, um, you know, biggest steps every day, and you know, hope I should be back out. What, what's the major thing, the, the next step you have to get to to be able to do? What's the, what's the one thing you're holding back right now? Uh, pretty much just. Uh, Really, you know, I just got to get my cardio up. Then after that, you know, hopefully I should be back, you know, be able to get, you know, like uh, contact drills. Then after that, you know, I should be ready. But you don't feel like you're you're limited, like physically, like like running and stuff? No, not really. But how eager are you to get back on the field and play in the game? Uh, you said what now? Uh, how eager are you? How, how excited are you to get on the field oh. and play in the game? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm, you know, I'm really excited. You know, uh, I really you know, play a lot at my other school, you know, and it's been a couple of years, you know, since I, you know, actually played. So, you know, it's going to feel really, really good getting back out there on the field. I wanted to ask you about that. How hard was the transfer for you to make that decision to move on and then to go through the process? Um, you know, it really wasn't, you know, too hard. You know, uh, at the end of the day, you know, it's, uh, you know, it's business, and, you know, I just love football, you know, and uh, it wasn't really hard. You know, uh, USC, you know, they made the transition pretty easy for me. So everybody helped out, you know, looked out for me, and, you know, I feel at home. It was really just, was, was it a playing time thing? You just wanted to find a bigger role somewhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's pretty much it. So when that process starts, how many schools do you hear from, and at what point does USC kind of become a focus? Uh, USC actually was probably one of the first schools to, you know, hit me up. You know, so you know, uh, as soon as, you know, I hopped in the border, you know, he was you know, right on, you know, and, uh, you know, me and him, you know, we made a great relationship over, you know, the recruitment process, and, you know, and after that, you know, uh, I felt that, you know, I needed to be here. What was it that allowed you to connect with him so quickly? Uh, I don't know. Uh, pretty much just, uh, you know, he just, you know, DM me, and then after that, you know, we started talking for a while, and, you know, after that, everything played out. What are you seeing from Corey Foreman and Jake Jackson since your time here? Uh, you know, uh, Corey, you know, we're a young guy, you know, but he out here, you know, he's busting his butt every day, you know, and uh, Drake, you know, he wanted to, you know, pretty much one of the veterans out here, you know, uh, he's been doing really, really good, you know, uh, it's exciting to play on both. At what point did the injury stuff kind of strike for you and you knew you had to get the procedure and everything? Uh, pretty much it was like, uh, it was it was one of the first practices, you know, and uh, that's when I got the injury. And after that, I had to, you know, the surgery. So this, this is like winter time out here? Uh, out here? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, springtime. It wasn't like a spring practice that was before that, right? It was like yeah. a workout. What did you feel? Uh, pretty much, you know, compartmental syndrome, you know, just, just pretty much just tightness in the legs. And after that, you know, you get checked out. And that's when they found out I had it, so I you know, had to do the Were you surprised by the diagnosis and everything? No, not really. Um, it, was it both legs? No, no. Just, just, just one? And what's it been like? When did you start feeling like yourself again, coming back through that? Um, how, how long did it take before you really felt you could move and stuff? Uh, pretty much during, uh, I'd say just, just a few months. You know, uh, USC, you know, they got a very good training staff. You know, um, you know they've been... Uh, you know, helping me out, you know, just, you know, helping me try to, you know, transition back out there on the field. And they've been doing a really, you know, good job at that, and uh, feeling good about it. Well, just two last ones. What, what do you want to prove or show this season or just in the, in the future? Uh, you know, I just want to go out there and prove, you know, that uh, I'm a good guy and, you know, that I can play with the best of them, you know, and just, you know, help the team out in the best way I can. And, and do you have an expectation for this season personally? Yeah, uh, yes, sir. Just to get out there, you know, play, you know, uh, play really hard, you know, and uh, hopefully, Lawrence will win the championship.